IDFS hosted a press conference held by parents of soldiers who died in their military units under non-combat circumstances. The parents of soldiers Ismail Libayev, Elkan Azizov, Pervis Iskandarli and Sadik Mamadov attended the conference. They expressed their dissatisfaction by saying the deaths of their sons were not investigated properly. The parents believed these deaths were not accidental. The improperly handled investigation and mistrial makes them think high-ranking military officials are to blame. They say investigation did not determine culprits, instead found defenseless soldiers guilty of this crime. The participants of the press conference emphasized that accused soldiers told the truth about deaths, but their testimony were not taken into consideration. The parents of soldiers Ismail Libayev and Pervis Iskandarli claimed that their son's internal organs had been removed. Parents of Elkan Azizov and Sadek Mamadov reminded how a similar case in Tashkent had been concealed. Five or so demise were recorded in one of the outfits of Tashkent in 2010, but arrested military officials were accused of taking bribe and embezzlement. Facing this kind of injustice, some parents could not take it any longer and died. Parents of 16 soldiers who died during military service have sent an appeal to the president and the only thing they want is a fair investigation. Parents believe that the guilt lies mainly with the defense minister and the military prosecutor office since defense minister takes no measures to prevent death in the army. As for the military prosecutor office, it conducts wrong investigations. It was noted at the press conference that in the past five months, 35 out of 43 soldiers died in non-combat conditions. The roundtable participants believe it is consequence of non-healthy state in the army. The way out of the situation is for the parents to see reforms in the army. According to them, the military prosecutor's office should be abolished and under the prosecutor general should be created a structure which will deal with these kinds of issues.